to the breaker. Trips immediately. Okay, I just posted a video asking people if they knew why that was tripping. The issue is, it is a GFI breaker. Now, the, when it's, if it was a single breaker and it was new, there's a chance it could be a GFI or an arc fault. But a two-pole breaker that old is most certainly a GFI breaker. And that little pigtail is the sign. And what he's done wrong is, when you have a GFI breaker, the hot goes here, the neutral of the circuit goes here, this pigtail goes to the neutral bar. He has run his neutral of the circuit straight to the neutral bar and not back to the breaker. If you want to know why that would make a trip, well, let's get into it. Okay, so in the normal circuit, you have a hot and a neutral. The electricity leaves on the hot, goes through his lamp, and comes back on the neutral. So say there's one amp here, one amp here. The GFI monitors that to make sure if one leaves, one comes back. There can be no difference between these two if it's operating properly. Now, if water or something was to get into this lamp or motor, whatever it is, some of the electricity might leave on this and come back on the ground because we have a ground fault and it wouldn't go through the loop inside the breaker and it would trip. It would see a difference because this would go to zero or less than one and you'd have a fault. That would be a ground fault breaker. That's what it looks for. Trips it out. Okay. What he's done in the video is he has his hot of the breaker, neutral. He has a hot he's not using. It's irrelevant. He has a lamp. Oh, I forgot the A. He ran his hot to the lamp. And the white that came back to the lamp should have gone here so that internally in the breaker, this could be monitored. But instead, what he did was he has a neutral bar over here in his panel, say, with some terminals. He ran the pigtail to here. And this wire went whoop, whoop, like that. So it was one amp on his breaker, and then it's one amp here. I mean, there's one amp going out to his lamp, came back, and went straight to the neutral bar, bypassing this. Circuit breaker had no chance to monitor it, looking for a difference. It saw a difference. It saw more going out than it did coming back. Shuts off. All right. There you go. All that other stuff, it's a two-pole breaker running a regular lamp. I'm not saying any of that is right or normal. There's a whole bunch of code violations in that panel. But for the one simple question, why was that breaker tripping? It's from what I just said. The white of the circuit, this one on the neutral bar, the hot of the circuit he put here, the neutral of the circuit, he didn't put on the breaker. He put off straight to the neutral bar. All right, click on the comment if you want to see the full video. Thanks.